Hi everyone! Hi. Welcome to our channel! So today we're gonna be um, whitewashing our plants. We just bought a, a new orange tree. Normally you uh, plant the tree and then you whitewash all in the same day, but we're not gonna have a lot of time. So we're gonna whitewash it and in a few days um, we'll have it in the ground probably by next week-ish we'll have that for you guys. Uh. So this is the whitewash that we use, the Ivy Organics, and it's a three-in-one um, plant guard. It's pretty nice, helps protect against sunburns and insects, and the really nice thing is the protection against rodents. Um, before I started putting this on, we had a lot of issues with uh, the rodents eating up our baby trees, the tops of it killing it off, uh, and even chewing around the bark to kill it off. But, you know, now they stopped doing it. Um, what's inside is the minerals that they use, and they use all natural minerals and oils and this is the oil that they use so we'll uh, I'll show you how it looks uh, how you put it together all right so the first thing we're going to do is pour the oil in to the container perfect It smells so good, huh? Yeah, it smells like peppermint. Mm -hmm. Okay. The next thing we're going to do is put in the powder. All of it? Mm -hmm. All of it. Yeah. Like that? Yeah. There you go. Great job, Jubilee. Oh, hold on. Sure. Yeah, it is. We're gonna keep it for something else later. It's fancy, huh? Yeah. Uh huh. Okay, so we got everything in there. Alright, guys, so we're gonna start by preparing the tree. It's gonna have a lot of these little um, tags on it and everything. And the one thing you want to do is you want to take this plastic tie off that they have to support because actually those ties they're tied on pretty tight nurseries do it and it um it chokes these uh plants so we'll take that all off and then we'll tie it on later ourselves with something that's nicer for the tree have all this stuff cut off the steak here we'll cut this piece and then we're gonna use this little yarn like this and tie it on right about right here and do something like this and tie it to the steak and not to the tree that way you don't cause any harm to the tree that's growing this will give it enough support so the wind can blow on it, but it'll also stand up straight. Okay, so we're gonna whitewash the tree now, and if you come up close, you can see uh, when I talked about we gotta take those um, the ties from the nursery. You can see how it damaged the tree a little bit because it was so tight. So you want to loosen that up for them so it doesn't do that. Now when we um, whitewash, usually with the graft, you'll see some open areas. You want to make sure you really put um, the, the oils on there because you don't want the bugs to come in and drill holes. I had a plant that I didn't do a good job putting the whitewash on and we had these beetles that dug into them and eventually killed the, the tree. 
So that's really about it. Just paint it on and I'll do it all the way to the top here. And we'll be back. Alright, so we just finished whitewashing everything with this tree. And we'll continue doing on the rest. And it's a pretty quick process. Just a quick paint and you're done. If you guys have any questions, place the comment below. Up. And press the subscribe button. Bye. Bye. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Next episode, we're gonna start a series on vegetable growing because all of our stuff is coming in. We'll see you soon. Bye.